the boy's love for the horse was genuine and not motivated out of some ulterior motive of greed or economic want after they took the option of hiding the horse for some time before giving it to the its real owner they were worried about where to hide the horse morad knew a place which could be perfect as a hidden spot morad walked the horse quietly to deserted vineyard and hid the horse in the barn which had once belonged to the farmer fadbian now what is a barn a barn is usually a large building used for the storage of farm products or for the housing of farm animals or farm equipments the deserted barn had some oats and dry flowering plants in it and they began walking home the horse now began to behave properly aram asked him how did he do that morat had a way with animals especially horses Morat knew how to handle every type of animal and also humans. Morat told Aram that he had a simple and deep understanding with the horse. Morat had the ability to control the movements of the horse and could make the horse do whatever he wanted. Morat told Aram that he was still a small boy of 9 years old and when he would be 13 he would know how to control a horse then aram returned to his home after hiding the horse in the barn of the farmer fadbian now let us see what happened when morat returned home after hiding the horse in this part we will get to know who was actually the owner of the horse in the afternoon uncle khoshrov came to aram's house for coffee and cigarettes sitting in the parlor which is a sitting room in the house khoshrov was talking about the good old things after some time john byro an assarian farmer also came he sighed sadly and told that his white horse had been stolen a month ago and he failed to understand where it had disappeared now student we have got to know the mystery behind as who is the owner of the house and it was none other than john byro who was an assarian assarian farmer aram also realized that the horse belonged to john byro When John Byro was telling about his tragedy of his lost horse Uncle Khoshrov was also present in Aram's house at that time and as we all familiar with Uncle Khoshrov's strange behavior he immediately reacted and expressed his anger and shouted it is no harm what is the loss of a horse he mocked him by saying that it was unnecessary to cry over a lost horse byro tried to convince that his sorry was useless without a horse and byro relied on the horse for transportation and without it he had to walk 10 miles with a sour leg to get to aram's house as uncle khoshrob was a city dweller he won't understand his condition but uncle khoshrob's khoshrob in spite of being sympathetic towards byro he rather shouted pay no attention to it displaying his crazy behavior byro said that the horse cost him 60 dollars again khoshrob mocked him by saying he spent on his money the incident ended at john byro walked out of the house angrily slamming the door the repetition of khoshrov's dialogue in appropriate in inappropriate situation do give us some comic relief 